Here is a quick tutorial on how to use the Cricut iron. My suggestion is that you take a few minutes and practice before your first event. We have provided you with all of the tools needed to execute this event. Scissors, weeder, ruler, chalk pencil, and a tea towel. We have also included a carrying bag and a full alphabet with at least 40 of each letter. At this point, you all should have your Cricut irons. You will need to preheat the iron before you begin each event. It is very important that you make sure the iron is not too hot. The second setting works best for this project. If the iron is too hot, it will melt the bag. First, you will need to mark the bag so that your letters will be even. Use your chalk pencil and ruler to create a line to use as your guide. I make two marks to make the line as straight as possible. Next, each alphabet sheet has a set of two letters, A, B, C, D, and so on. Find the letters you need and cut them out. Remember to leave space on each side and if possible, cut each letter about the same size. A side note, I cut my letters out prior to the event and have each letter in a bag or container. It speeds up the event. Now that your letters are cut, you will need to use the weeder to remove the excess material around the letters. Start near the edge of the excess material and lift the material and peel it away. The letter will stay in place. Before placing letters, take the tea towel and place inside the bag on the area near where the letters will be heated. The next step is to place your letters on the bag. I find that two initials is much easier than placing three initials. Lining them up is the trickiest part. Please remember to center your letters under the zippered pocket on the diesel bag. We are now ready to adhere the letters. Once your letters are in place, carefully place the parchment paper over the letter. Careful not to move the letters in the process. Place the iron on top of the letters and slowly move the iron around over both letters for about 20 seconds. Remove the iron, wait 10 seconds, and place the iron back on the parchment paper again for about 10 to 15 seconds. Lift the parchment paper and check the letters. The plastic liner should lift easily from the bag with the letters fully adhered to the bag. If you see the letters lifting, please replace the parchment paper and heat for an additional 10 seconds and then repeat. Remove the pa parchment paper and check the letters. Once complete, take a damp cloth and wipe line away.